Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today, we're going to talk about a conversation I had with my son. And him throwing my own words back at me. <laughs> um, and, and, and where it leads. Because it actually touches on a couple of interesting points. My son is eight. He has seen a Christmas card before. I, I'm sure of it. I know he has, but for whatever reason, a Christmas card that just showed up at my house, he asked what it was, and I told him it was a Christmas card, and he's like, yeah, but what is it? And he already has, like, this tone. I'm like, okay, I'm like, it's a Christmas card, and I hand it to him, and he opens it up, he looks at it, looks at both sides, and he's like, why do people send these? I'm like, well, it's uh, you know a way of saying hello around the holidays, wishing people a Merry Christmas. You know, he's like, yeah, why don't they send a text? I'm like, I, I don't know. It's tradition. The, the fill of the paper, the imagery on the cardstock. I, I don't know. And he's, when I say tradition, he gets this look on his face, and I know that I have messed up at this point in the conversation, but he just skips right over that for the moment. Um, and he says, he says, he's like, you know, there are pictures of Christmas on the internet, right? <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, I'm aware of that, man. <laughs> he's like, do we send Christmas cards to people in an incredibly accusatory tone? And I kind of like, you know, just stand there with this look on my face because I honestly don't know the answer. And he's like, I'll ask mom later. I'm like, yeah, it's probably a good move, kid. Um. And then he comes back to, is there any reason that, that we send these other than tradition? And the tone in his voice was uh, something to be remembered. And I'm like, not that I know of. And he's like, yeah, you know that tradition is just peer pressure from dead people, right? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm aware of that. And he was like, and you know that just because we always did something one way isn't a reason to continue doing it that way if a better option presents itself. And I'm like, yeah, I remember telling you all of this. <laughs> but at this point, I still don't actually know why he's mad. I don't know <laughs> what his conflict with Christmas cards is until he says... How many Christmas cards does one tree make? Got it. Very environmentally conscious kid, by the way. Uh, I didn't know the answer offhand. So this is uh, napkin math based on estimates I found online. One tree produces about 3,000 Christmas cards. The, in the United States, we send about 1.3 billion per year. When you include envelopes and stuff like that, you're looking at about half a million trees per year. Um, so the next part to this is that I'm certain that my older son and basically everybody of that generation, they're they're going to do away with Christmas cards. That that tradition will fade. They will not succumb to that peer pressure. And it's probably a good thing. So, one thing that everybody needs to prepare themselves for is the Republican Party calling this part of the war on Christmas because you know it's coming. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.